Good day friends, this is TV Ganesh. Welcome to our channel, System Tour. Please subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon. In this video, we are going to see about a common problem and a simple solution. Here it is. I am using an Excel file which has serial number in the first column. Whenever I delete some rows, I am getting hashref error. How to avoid it? Well, lot of people have come across these kind of issues in MS Excel. So now we are going to see about a simple trick which will convert hashref to hash free. Let's see how the trick is. So I am going to take an Excel file here which has serial number in the A column. So let me delete everything and start a fresh one in order to include the serial number here. Let me type 1 and press enter. Again 2 enter. We can combine both and then on the right extreme side you will be seeing a plus symbol right. Just double click that icon so that uh, it will get pasted to the entire sheet. And randomly I am going to delete a particular row and check whether I am getting the hashref error or not. So in this case I did not get the hashref error but unfortunately the serial number 9 is missing. So what I have to do again I need to go and select the first two cells. Again I do the same activity. I am going to use a next strategy to check whether I am getting the hashref error or not. So here I am placing the cursor in A5. Put equal to refer the above cell plus 1 and press enter. Now the same way on the right extreme side just double click so that it will filled to the entire range. Randomly select one particular row and then right click on that row click delete. Yeah, I am getting the hashtag error here. So this is what the user is also experiencing, right? Now let us check what would be the best way to avoid these kind of issues here. So now I am going to use a formula called row equal to row of open parenthesis close parenthesis press enter i'm getting the answer as 4 because 4 is the active row here and apart from that we have three first rows right okay so what we can do here is put equal to row open parenthesis close parenthesis press enter so that you will get the answer as 4 and then on the formula bar you can also include minus 3 so that you will be getting the serial number as 1. Why 3? Because first 3 rows have been excluded as serial number here, right? Okay, now copy paste to the entire range or on the right extreme side you can double click that icon, the plus symbol. Now randomly go ahead and delete a particular row. Yes, it's been automated now. Even though if you delete multiple times, automatically the serial numbers are getting adjusted. So in this way, you can completely automate the serial number column. I hope you enjoy this video. Please do share with your friends and colleagues. Thank you and have an excellent day.